Well, new at midday, CCSD is prepping for a virtual school year. And right now, the school district is holding an online meeting to make sure students and parents get the information they need ahead of the first day of class. 13 Action News reporter Kelsey McFarlane is live right now outside of CCSD headquarters to explain what resources are available. Kelsey? Yeah, Kalina, that meeting kicked off just about 30 minutes ago. The two major topics, registration and zoning. They'd like parents to have that all lined up before the first day of school. Now, according to the school district's website, Chromebook distribution should have started last week. CCSD says registration is critical to make sure students have all the equipment they need. That way, the school district will know whether or not your student has a Chromebook and if they need help getting Internet access. Now, if you are worried about your student being able to connect to reliable Wi-Fi, the Las Vegas Chamber of Commerce, Clark County Library District, and local businesses have partnered with the school district to set up Wi-Fi spots across the valley. That list is online. Now, if needed, the district can also dispatch school buses with Wi-Fi hotspots. The district also has a new interactive map tool on their website that allows parents to see which schools they are zoned for. Now, the meeting happening right now is not available to the public, but later today, Superintendent Jesus Jara will hold a virtual town hall for parents and students to submit their questions. That starts at 430. For the meeting happening right now, I'll tune in and see what's happening. I'll bring you some more insight at the 3 o'clock newscast. Reporting live, I'm Kelsey McFarland, 13 Action News. All right, Kelsey, thank you so much. And even though CCSD students will be learning from home this fall, your kids will still get the food they need. Starting August 24th, There'll be 300 sites giving food to students who qualify for free meals. Elementary, middle school and high school students will pick up their food at different times and they'll also get both breakfast and lunch. We do have more information about the food service on our website. Just head over to KTNV.com.